the success it has. When we started, I tried to lay out um, what I felt we were trying to do here. That is uh, to exchange ideas and opinions on micro credentials, obviously, um, to build capacity for co designing uh, for micro learning, encourage communication between stakeholders, you uh, in the Southeast Asian region, and create contacts between people. I'm very happy that in the last eight hours, um, uh, we have exceeded even even the most optimistic expectations here in the meeting room online um, during the sessions and outside in the social uh, events in the tea and coffee breaks. Um, it was very good. <laughs> um, and I hope that the contacts that have been made here will continue, that it will be uh, sustainable um, and uh, I'm I'm convinced that that would be very useful. Uh, so this has been a microcasa event. Microcasa is still relatively new, even though the team is already uh, playing really well together. Um, but clearly, this is just the first step. And uh, even though I I believe we made a great step today, um, and and we had heard very comprehensive talks. And I will not even try to summarize them here. Uh, instead, I, I would like to share you with you my, my personal view of the meeting. Um, today, we are standing at a threshold to new forms of learning and instruction. I think that was made clear and very impressively clear. I was struck several times by um, how the topic of micro-credentials in the center and mediator of multiple major educational trends and challenges, concepts like AI in education, Carlos, uh, co-design, quality control, learners as customers, not users, kept coming back in many of the talks and discussions. With, with this in mind, I think we have to understand that academia and our product uh, is changing. Now we deal with many quality control issues that relate to equity, addressing not only a small elite, um, of academics with uh, beneficial prerequisites for learning, but also the underprivileged and marginalized. While we have no good answer to many of the problems like plagiarism and cheating with AI, uh, we already have to create the future of education with AI. Ultimately, this cannot be two separate tasks that we balance, but has to be one and the same task. Uh, today, we have not argued to replace one thing with another uh not micro instead of macro not machine instead of human interaction but a smart combination of approaches and the smart lies yes it lies in the machine but it also lies within us within our capacity that we're trying to build here uh, and this has been really a mutual process i have learned a lot so with all these tasks to complete and complete in parallel at the same time it is not surprising that we also heard talk on stress and overburdening teachers, instructional designers, and that triggered many bells with me and also many other participants. So we can summarize this by saying that an educator today has many more tasks than just just teaching and certainly also much more than just pushing buttons to switch the learning environment on or off. In this context, I believe that this issue of stress is something that we have to take very seriously. We need to supply teachers with uh, better tools to do the job, AI, design tools, etc. And in addition, we also need to give teachers the optimum environment in which to work, and we should remember to consult them when designing and or changing this environment. That is, we should co-design education, because in the end, it is relatively easy to find excellent tools, but it might be just, just very difficult um, to, to replace good teachers. Good teachers are hard to find and even harder to keep. I feel, uh, along with many others, that this workshop is very useful and should continue. Uh, within the microcasa project, we continue to work on building capacity in the region. We have studied the state of the art of micro credentials in work package once by the Italian team of Cimea, 
uh, Manuela, Federico, Francesco. We are building capacity in work package two. Peter Sai has been doing that here. And uh, well, yeah, so, so this is something you experienced here. In work package three, we are creating micro courses. So this is something that will come up and you will see on our web page as well. Interesting micro courses to take. Um, in work package four, we are developing quality control. You just heard Andre. And in work package five, we are disseminating our work. We hope to reach you, but you also have to give us a chance to reach you. Uh, maybe follow us. Uh, website. Yeah, there is a website, uh, microcasa at uh, uh, .eu. And we are really present on different social media, and Razia is organizing that. Uh, the website is managed by Carlos and Carlos. Um, and um, yeah, and, and the social media is organized by Razia. Uh, what am I doing in this project? Ah, yeah, I'm, I'm doing the project lead. It's where package six, there's a management. Um, and that is Isabel and I. Isabel is actually running the show. I'm just a clown uh, who speaks, uh, but <laughs> yeah, many thanks to you, Isabel. Um, yeah, uh, speaking of Razia, uh, I, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to hosting this event. The most important thing about any of such a. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes. The, the most important thing about about uh, a successful workshop is the organizing team. So your team, Razia, you and your team your staff is, is just amazing. And we it was a pleasure uh, uh, to to meet here. It was also a pleasure to meet them right here, right now. And um, yeah, again, the project is only beginning, actually. Yeah, we're like half a year in. We have two and a half years to go. Um, and we hope to show our hospitality also in a similar manner, even though that will be very difficult to match. <laughs> but we try. We, we try. We have also, you know, uh, nice places to go to. I'm looking at the uh, Spanish and uh, Italian team, so... <laughs> Madrid in Rome is waiting for us, but we will also come back to Asia and would like to interest you also to uh, to uh, keep connected and we find ways to also facilitate processes of design, because maybe this is also the beginning for you in a way, and, and then we would like to be there for you as well. Um, yeah, so, so this is it from my side. Is there anyone who wants to maybe share? uh your perspective on the workshop also wants to conclude in some ways yes yes Thank you. Uh, I'm sure. I'm in for the one to Yeah, uh, just adding a small piece of it. I, I, today I noticed that Malaysia is at a very exciting point and we've come to uh, USM and a lot of people are having more questions than answers. Right? So, I mean, after the discussion during the tea break, I just realized that uh, there's a need to take note that this workshop has proven that micro credentials is the way forward and riding on new technology is also something very important. Unfortunately, our job is only one plate, but many more plates are coming on it. Mm -hmm. Right? So, so that's, that's the challenge. And sadly, standards are not there yet. Right? And you can't find anybody to ask the questions to, right? Fortunately, uh, the world leaders have come to Malaysia and Penang. I mean, they are here standing in front of us. And I think uh, for Malaysia, your contact is Razia, right? Uh, please uh, continue to look forward towards what we are doing, but don't uh, kind of be little or put lesser your own effort. I see some of you are already pioneering, doing something very exciting, right? So be explorative. Do what you're doing, talk to everybody, and uh, talk more to us as well. And we look forward to building bridges and looking at way forward 
take what we have learned today to the next level. We have to tell the ministry what to do. Right? I mean, that's, that's something. It's not just a choice. I mean, if they feel that you cut your courses, my credential appears. No, no, no. Right? So we have to tell them that reality is not easy and we must all play our part. Thank you very much. Sorry if I missed. Thank you. Thank you very much, Nara. Yes, so so oh, nice. so yeah, I'm great. So then if if we wrap it up like that, I would really like to give then the last word to the wonderful host Razia to to come really conclude. Thank you very much. All right. Um uh, so you know, you have a thought of I uh, take one point from today, and basically we have a lot of words to do. Okay, and you know more discussions that we need to uh continue. Okay, so I would like to announce this is sort of early announcement. Okay, whatever that we will be doing next, okay, you'll be working on micro credential at your respective institutions. Um, as an education, we also need to uh, do research on you know uh, our teaching and learning on micro credential. So do join us in the final conference, the last quarter of 2025. Okay, on micro credentials. Okay, so with that, uh, thank you everyone for coming. Okay, all the way to US MP9 and for those joining us online, thank you as well. Okay, uh, have a safe uh, travel back home. Thank you. Thanks. Yeah, so uh, a kind reminder, uh, please uh, provide us with your feedbacks. Your feedbacks are uh, will be valuable for our future um, references. And also do like, Comment us, follow us everywhere we go. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, feel free to contact us anytime. Thank you very much. See you again. Bye. A new. By the way, are you changing USM by new signs, really? Because I see this letter. Oh, USM, yeah, for, you know, like we are charging for this deal. Facility, rental, special arm. Yeah, special arm.